All right, no need for an intro. You guys already know what's going on. And we're after that bird right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, here we go, guys. Oh, big old spruce. Look at that size of him. Smash that thumbs up. Come on. First grouse of the fall. Let's keep going. Well, we've been down the road. That one just back there. We've been down there for about 20 minutes. Haven't seen any birds pop up out of there. Making our way back to the main highway. And when I say we, it's me and Cooper. Just watch your face here, bud. A bunch of branches hitting the truck. But yeah, we got the one bird. So what I'm doing right here, if you guys ain't familiar with the way I hunt these birds, I'll walk or drive up and down these old logging roads. I'll keep my eyes down at the bottom of the, the bush or on the top of the trees uh, later in the morning. After they're done eating, they're gonna be roosting up top. They'll be up high in the trees. And that's why I always say keep your eyes in the trees because a lot of times, maybe 80% of the birds that I shoot, they're up high. And if there's any question of shooting these birds while they're flying yes i do shoot them when they're flying if it's in an open area obviously i'm hunting these birds in thick wooded area because i got no prairie we got no prairies up here to hunt birds and there wouldn't be any spruce grouse or rough grouse in the prairies anyways hunting them in the bush that's why you got to take your shots when they present themselves especially when you're hunting in thick bush like this Watch your steps there, bud. Oh, that's hard to put this on my hat. I got a big old spruce. Cooper, here. Here, here. Stay. 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 Just let me spot this here. Hang on. Boy, he's just amped right up. Stay. 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 Cooper. He wasn't very high. Oh, there he is, I see him. Right up top there. Wrong way, bud. This way. So thick in here for him. Hang on, son. Always make sure your gun's unloaded, guys. No. Ouch. Cooper here. Oh, we got another one up there. Hang on, Coop. Oh. Hang on, son. Did you find him? We got one more here. Hang on. Cooper here. Oh man, he's loving it. Oh, right there. Got him. Good job, son. Good job. Okay, we got one more son. You found that one for me. <laughs> it's right in here, bud. Can you find them? I see his, no, 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 no. I see his feathers here. I can hear some chickens over here squawking. That's too far, Cooper. Cooper, this way. He's in here somewhere. See, there's his feathers there. 
There's more feathers right there. I think that's from this bird. Okay, now I can't see where he is. Okay, I gotta go backtrack where I was here. <laughs> All right, Cooper found him. Good job, son. Here we go, there's our third bird. Good job, Cooper. You guys gotta hit that thumbs up for old Cooper Roo. Good job, buddy. What a good boy. Good job. Nose deep in chicken feathers. You watch your belly on those branches. Come this way, it's easier this way. Good job, buddy. Good job. I think all we had was two spoons here. Oh yeah, good job. Loda. Good job. Find him. Chase him. Chase him. Hold. Cooper, hold. Good job. Here. Cooper, here. Here. Okay, you chased him up in a tree here. Here. Cooper, I think we lost him. Here. Cooper, here. Cooper, here. Extra determined to find this chicken. Cooper, here now. Cooper! Here. Cooper, here. He's gone. There was only one in here. <laughs> Good job though. Man. Yeah, he chased him up in a tree and then I couldn't... Couldn't see him right away because I was busy trying to load my gun. Good job buddy, let's go, come on. It's gone. Top of me here. Cooper, right here. That one was a gut buster shot. So we had two in here and we got the one out of here. Cooper the chicken dog. The chicken dog. Yeah, I'm not gonna waste too much time looking for this one. I'm just gonna pick up here and then get out of here. 
All right, I got the birds all cleaned up, put away for supper tonight. Again, you guys, thank you so much for joining me and Cooper. Not a whole bunch of birds fell today. And I just want to say that I am not a professional dog trainer, but I trained Cooper since he was a pup on how to retrieve. And yeah, he's gotten a lot better. And yeah, he did develop this little zigzag pattern when we're grouse hunting that I noticed the last few times when I was hunting with him, that he'll zigzag to help me find the birds that fall. If he can't see them where they landed, he will zigzag back and forth until he finds it, pick it up and he'll bring it to me if I'm busy trying to find another bird or if I just let him do it. He is the best hunting partner I have. Like he is an awesome, awesome dog. It's just amazing to watch him find these birds and pick them up for me and bring them to me it's a lot of fun and he loves being out there as you guys could tell from seeing him running back and forth and just enjoying it out there enjoying hunting with me and that's about going to do it for the video guys thank you so much for joining us today stay tuned we got more grouse hunting coming duck hunting a whole bunch of other outdoor stuff going on so consider subscribing smash the thumbs up and we'll get you guys on the next episode and have an awesome day